The product of good genes, Sharif O'Neal, the son of Hall of Famer Shaquille O'Neal, is one of the best college prospects in the country. Still young in the sport, Sharif has had impressive runs and an amazing combination of size, athleticism, and skill. Being the son of an NBA legend, we sure have expectations from him. But the question is, will he be able to meet these expectations? Just how good is Sharif O'Neal? Our video speaks it all. So tell me, who is your biggest role model in your life? Obviously, your dad plays a big part. Would you say is your biggest role model, or who's affected your journey till till uh, this point? Uh, any anybody besides my dad? Yeah. Um, my mom. I'd say my mom's there. Let's have a little chat about the legendary Shaquille O'Neal before we get into his promising son. Shaquille O'Neal was one of the most dominant college players of all time. The seven-footer was a titan in the post and could outdo any player he was matched up with. And why do I say that? Well, this is backed up by his impressive points, rebounds, and blocks per game. In his junior season at LSU, Shaq averaged 24.1 points, 14 rebounds, and 5.2 blocks per game. Those are numbers nobody had averaged before. Of course, he further proved himself in the NBA throughout his 19-year Hall of Fame career. A legend indeed. Without making a face. No water no. yet. No water yet, brother. Just nothing to me. Ah. Uh, <laughs> is that a little? <laughs> I'm not making a face, bro. Sharif spent the majority of his time living in his father's shadow and has constantly been trying to pave his own in the world of basketball. His game is naturally compared to his father's dominant style of play on the court, from his slam dunks on defenders and insane rebounding capabilities on both sides of the court. These are the talents that got Shaq into the Hall of Fame, a path that Sharif intends to follow in his own way. Earlier on in his basketball career, Sharif was labeled a bust due to not having his father's dominating physique and style of play. So back to Sharif. Born January 11, 2000 in Los Angeles, O'Neal is the son of former National Basketball Association, or NBA, player Shaquille O'Neal and Shawnee O'Neal. Despite his father's basketball fame, Sharif grew up without a passion for the game and preferred skateboarding. His interest in basketball grew after he had a disappointing performance at a middle school amateur athletic union game and was prompted to prove everybody wrong on the court. At age 13, O'Neal began training regularly and was able to dunk. According to 247 Sports, Sharif O'Neal was the number 16 player in the class of 2018. So we must admit he's good, but is he that good? What's up all his life? Welcome to Day in Life with me, Shakira O'Neal. Today, I'm gonna take you guys to my dream dungeon. Let's go. O'Neal is six foot 10 and quite agile for his size. Without a doubt, Sharif is good for a college student, but could O'Neal actually follow in his father's footsteps and be one of the next great big players? Of course, it's too early to tell, but Shaq strongly believes in his son and thinks Sharif is better than he was when he was a junior in high school. He's really good, O'Neal told CBS Sports, way better than I was at his age. Sharif has a lot of colleges looking at him, and I am very, very proud of him. Shaq was dominant in high school, leading Robert G. Cole High School in San Antonio to a 68-1 record in his two years there, and the state title as a senior. So his claim that his son is better than he was is a bit, let's say, bold. Of course, based on his track record, making bold claims is nothing new for Shaq, though. But as a proud father, Shaq has every reason to be bragging about his son. Every father would. Also, Sharif can easily dunk on his dad. One thing is for sure, if Sharif O'Neal continues on the path he's on, Shaq's proclamation that both of his sons will make the league will very likely become at least half true. Tell them all the time, we don't need basketball. We need lawyers, we need doctors, we need hedge fund people in our family, we need people that can do stuff like that. Sharif O'Neal is hoping to at least have a similar impact his father had at college and NBA level, although it'll be hard, if not impossible, to outperform his father. Early signs aren't as promising, given he averaged only 2.2 points and 2.9 rebounds per game in 13 games at UCLA last season. Still, the 21-year-old has already overcome several obstacles and now finally seems poised to become the player many expect he could be. He went and got a cut and came back oh, yeah, to practice. Oh yeah, he had to kick him out yeah. of practice. It's here with Sharif O'Neal with a follow in UCLA back within 11. 11. Even though his development has stalled since graduating high school, Sharif was highly regarded just a couple of years ago. He played at Crossroads School in Santa Monica and went viral after several of his videos were shared on the internet. In fact, he was ranked among the top 50 high school players in the nation by both Rivals and ESPN, while 247 Sports had him at number 52. 
At the age of 13, most people can't dunk basketball, but that's precisely what Sharif was doing. It shouldn't be a surprise considering his 6 foot 10 frame and the fact his dad was one of the most potent dunkers of all time. It's still an impressive feat though, giving the average 13 year old can't even jump and touch the rim. As a player for Crossroads School, Sharif was eyed by several schools. In fact, even as a freshman at Windward School, he received scholarship offers from Baylor, LSU, UCLA, and USC, even though he only averaged 3.7 points and 2.9 rebounds per game. USC was the first school to offer him a scholarship, but he waited two years before selecting one. Sharif is a high-level power forward prospect who possesses excellent athleticism and an emerging offensive game. He's young and not yet consistent, but he shows flashes of what he can become. If he puts it all together, we believe he'll have a long NBA career. To add to that, O'Neal is a well-coordinated athlete with good strength and a solid build. He runs the court well and has an excellent leaping ability, allowing him to make plays above the rim, not forgetting that he is a high-level dunker with nice touch around the basket. He shows excellent timing as a weak side shot blocker and impressive length and leaping ability on the defensive end. Although he projects as a power forward, Sharif shows several wing traits and is developing nice perimeter skills, including an improved handle and expanded range on his jumper. He also has a very smooth release on his shot and can hit out to college three. He shoots from a high spot with good rhythm and excellent form. His ability to play on the wing at his size is impressive. As a matter of fact, if he continues to develop his ball skills, he'll be a load to handle. Compared to his dad, Sharif's style of play is very different. He can rebound and viciously dunk just like his dad, but he also has developed an excellent jump shot that is lethal from anywhere on the court. Another quality that sets Sharif apart from his dad is his ability to make free throws. It was his dad's kryptonite, but a weakness that Sharif has overcome and strengthened. Sharif has shown that he has a tremendous talent finishing around the basket. Defenders don't stand a chance guarding him in the paint, and he can also mix it up and take his defender to the perimeter. Quite impressive, right? However, he was still denied a spot to play in the McDonald's All-American Game, where the top high school basketball players in the country compete against each other despite his diverse basketball skill set. Sharif announced that he is transferring from UCLA to LSU, where Shaq was a two-time All-American. He began his career with UCLA, but a severe heart condition forced him to miss the entire 2018-2019 to season. Indeed, it will be hard for Sharif to match what his father accomplished at LSU. Nonetheless, it's pretty cool to see him carry on the O'Neill legacy in Baton Rouge. LSU was one of the first schools that recruited me, and um, I feel like when I went there to visit, it was like home. You know, people there didn't really, they didn't talk about my dad one time, and now that kind of what, what stood out to me. Like, even though there's a statue outside the stadium, they didn't, they didn't say, we want you to be better than your dad. We want you to be your dad. They're like, we want you to be Sharif. Like, people here love you. So what do you think? What are your thoughts regarding Sharif O'Neal? Do you think he will live up to his father's reputation? And do you believe he's actually as good as the media makes him look? Let us know in the comment section below. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more of our amazing content. Please give us a like, share the video, and don't forget to turn on the notification bell for timely updates of our new uploads. We value your feedback, so feel free to share your thoughts with us in the comment section below. <laughs> Get the sleep on. <laughs>